every single time I come home, I live with five, well, I'm one of five people in this flat. And I swear to God, you would have absolutely no idea that I live with other people. Anyway, what's up guys, and welcome back to LSJ TV. Hopefully you enjoyed that little bonfire night mix at the start. I was gonna vlog it, but then I thought, you know what? I've recorded so much lately, I just wanna enjoy the night. Maybe go on a ride or two and just enjoy the fireworks. So it was a great night with great company. Thank you to everyone involved, you know exactly who you are. So, without further ado guys, I'm actually gonna go back in time to the gym session that I had earlier. It was leg day, it was an amazing session, just to give you a heads up. It's gonna be a commentary, so here we go. How's it going guys? Hopefully you are enjoying the video so far. If you are, then let me know by leaving a like, comment and subscribe down below if you are new to the channel. What I'm going to be taking you guys through today is one of two of my leg workouts. I'm actually following a five day split at the minute, three upper and two lower, with the three upper body workouts being one chest emphasis, one shoulder emphasis and one back emphasis. The lower body workouts, they consist of one back squat workout, which is what you're seeing here today, and one front squat workout. It's nice to mix it up every now and then, and as you guys can see here, today I'm squatting 110 kilograms. That was for eight solid reps. I actually upped it because I've been doing 100 to 105. I actually went there or thereabouts with 107.5, and this went up nice and cleanly, a little bit struggling towards the end, to be honest with you guys. But actually, you know what? Three solid sets on that, I will take it. The next movement up, was stiff legged deadlifts again everything has been up today so as long as basically one tip that i would give you guys when you're training legs is you will be pretty much you'll be pretty sound as long as you keep your heels on the floor drive through your heels that is the same with this next exercise guys that is the same with leg press as you can see in a minute guys that will be supersetted with calf raises i like to do this just to save time purely because it's a public gym it's a busy gym and if i can bash out two exercises in one go on one machine then i will do so they, both of these exercises were actually up to one, two, five kilograms today, guys. So this, everything, even in the chest day, uh, the day before, everything was up in that as well. As you guys can see here, we are moving on to the isolations for the day. We are moving on to the leg extension and the hamstring curl, both with a two-second pause at the bottom and a slow, controlled negative. And that is it for today's workout, guys. Stay tuned for the front squat workout, maybe next week or the week after, guys. And back to me. Ladies and gentlemen, people of the internet, I have a dilemma. Now you guys have seen me in the gym a hell of a lot over the last few videos. That is getting very, very difficult. As many of you guys will know, I'm doing my actual dissertation, which is what you have to do at uni in your third year, in your final year, whatever your final year is. I am doing my dissertation at the gym. The same gym that I film at. Now you guys have seen me being told to stop recording once or twice at least on the channel, right? Long story short, that can't happen. I need access to that gym for my dissertation. To complete the third year of my uni university degree, I need to have access to that gym. I cannot get kicked out of that gym. You see where I'm going with this? So basically with me getting to know the gym owners, them getting to know me and my face and why I'm supposed to be there, they'll just be looking at me and thinking, Liam, what the fuck are you doing with that camera? But I've been thinking and it's not necessarily the worst thing in the world. The reason being is that this channel is not all about fitness, it is a big, it's a massive part, you know, the, the root of it, the core of it is LSJ Fitness, right? But it isn't absolutely everything. I show you guys everything, I show you guys me building the business from the ground up, yes, the LSJ Fitness side of things, but then I show you university, I show you home life, like you guys have seen my dogs, you guys have seen my family at some stages. Like, I show you absolutely everything and we go through this roller coaster that we call life together. Together, we will grow on this channel, guys. It's not all about fitness. Fitness is a massive part of it. And yes, I'm doing my PT qualifications and everything. But in terms of the longevity of this channel, I'm at university for another ho a whole another year. I've got one year left, guys. That is a lot longer than it does seem. So I kind of have to preserve the time that I have here and not get myself into any shit. 
So I'm not saying that the gym footage is going to stop, it's not, because I love giving that informative content, I love doing the walkthroughs, they are one of my favourite videos to actually do in like in the world, of sec probably second behind highlights anyway, because I get to do what I love, I get to train and I get to walk through it with you guys at the same time. But that is not going to stop, because that is at the core of the channel, that will always, always, always be there. But. You guys can probably just expect a little bit more lifestyle kind of stuff. What I do, full days of eating have been requested, more business stuff has been requested, all kinds of stuff guys, so you might not see just as much gym footage, but you know what, that's okay, because it is a part of our life, but it isn't absolutely everything. So like I say, just gonna have to see how it goes, and sort of, sort of play it by ear. If I take my camera with me every single time like I do anyway, then if it's a little bit too busy, I might just have to call it a day just because I don't want to cause any issues. I literally, I, ca I can't emphasize enough, I cannot risk losing access to that gym. I just can't. It is everything for me finishing this degree and it's everything for me for, essentially I spent £50,000 on this degree. I would hate to mess it up just because I wanted to record one more workout when I didn't necessarily have to. I could have showed you some business stuff. I could have showed you some more of Nottingham. I could have showed you absolutely anything guys. I just don't want to mess it up. I've got to be careful but we'll see how it goes. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon YouTube. Whenever you happen to be watching this video, if you are enjoying it so far then let me know by leaving a like. It is the morning time now and I am about to tuck into some of this Greek yogurt, 0.5 grams of fat per 100 grams and there's only 500 grams in the entire tub. What I wanted to just quickly do guys is give you a little bit of a dissertation update. I've been promising it on my Instagram and Facebook and I've been having a few questions about what I'm doing in terms, not only in person, but over DMs as well. So I'll give you guys a little bit of an update. So essentially what I'm doing is a lot of reading. And as you can see up the top here, guys, this is called Pumping Irony. I know, right? The irony is incredible. And basically, uh, all I have to do is read stuff like this that is going to be relevant to what I'm doing. So I'm doing an ethnographic study. That basically means I'm going to be looking at gym culture, bodybuilding culture, specifically at uni, within students and stuff like that. So it's really interesting. Like what I said in the last video, guys, when I seen some interesting behavior in the gym, that kind of stuff is gonna be noted in my dissertation and it's noted in little papers like this that I've had to read and you have to build up a reference list and then eventually hand that in. That's due in on Friday. This is coming out on Wednesday and so it's due in tomorrow as of this video coming out. No, Friday, tomorrow, it's due in two days as after this video comes out. So as you guys can see, this is very, very entertaining stuff, right? And basically what I do is just go throughout and make notes as to what I think will be useful when I write my actual dissertation in a few months time, because then I have to do the research and everything like that, blah, 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 blah. But in all seriousness, one thing is worth highlighting. I do feel very, very fortunate to be in a position to do a dissertation around something that I love. At the end of the day, the gym and like YouTube and social media, that is gonna be a factor in the dissertation as well. Everything like that is, is my passion, it's what I love, it's what I love to do, and so I don't mind reading about it, and so I do feel very, very fortunate to be able to be in this position that I am right now. I know people that hate, absolutely despise what they're doing for their dissertation, and to be honest guys, I'm really enjoying this so far, and I'm really looking forward to sort of getting involved and doing the research myself in the gym. Like, I'm going to be in the gym for my dissertation. You guys can't even, I can't even, I can't, even, I can't, even, I can't explain how excited I am to do that. So I'm gonna carry on reading this beauty, and I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Okay, so it's a little bit later on in the day now, and as you guys can see, I've just been editing this video, which you are. I've just been editing this video, which you guys are watching right now, and I've seen that it is plenty long enough. I was actually going to carry it on for another day, but instead, I'm just going to round it off here and then carry on the story in another video. So that is going to wrap up episode 44 of the growth series. Now another question I've been getting is what does growth stand for? What does it mean? Why is your series called growth? Why have you had the consistency series? Why have you had the growth series? So if you would like me to do a Q&A answering a few of those questions then leave a comment down below, leave a like or send me a message or do all of the above and that would be greatly appreciated. Your feedback does help me out a hell of a lot more than you guys expect. So as I say guys, that is gonna round off today's video. Episode 44 of the Grow Series. Can you believe it? What a way we have come. Together we will grow. So thank you guys so much for watching today. As always remember, no regrets. I'll see you guys in the next video.